What is going on guys, this is today I'm bringing you guys another video, the third video in a row today. And today's video we're going to be talking about, not gaming, but a person, and it's White Boy 7th Street and he got arrested. So uh, let's talk about it and what's going to happen. So uh, so this is the scenario, so he was live streaming DayZ, which is a pretty good game, I don't know why I'm not talking about it, but he was live streaming DayZ and he gets a knock on the door and he switches just to the uh, webcam only like in full screen on the stream so it had lag so the, by the time it showed the webcam and the twitch stream was updated he was already gone and his chair was uh, you know like swiveling around and stuff like that so uh, he was gone and he didn't appear in the stream for the he, he didn't appear for the rest of the stream so, uh, I don't know how it ended. I think Twitch, like, ended it or something. I'm not sure. But, uh, he's still, he be, to this day, he's still streaming that one, I, I don't know, but, uh, but, uh, apparently, like, it, and then, after, like, f I think a couple minutes, you see a police officer and a dog walk in, and it was confirmed it was a, uh, actual police officer. It walks in, looks at something, and then walks out. And that was basically like the last of any action in the uh, live stream, and you know, um, and this is also Call of Duty MW2 Zombies. This is also um, it's mod, it's a mod, um, and it's uh, yeah. So, uh, anyways, he uh, so how so how did the cop just show up at his door? Well, he got swatted. If you guys don't know what that means, it means when someone calls the cops or. Yeah, they'll call the cops saying, oh, this guy has a bomb or, you know, whatever. Or he has, like, a bunch of drugs. And, you know, of course they'll lie. But the police always have to respond to those calls because you never know. It could be real. So they went to his house. They knocked on his door. And, you know, they had, I think they had, like, bomb squad people there. And they had the canine unit that was supposed, that is trained to send out, sent, uh, out drugs and, uh, and bombs. So, uh, they went into his house. I don't know how, but he they went into his house and uh, they uh, found marijuana. Like after searching his house for bombs, they found marijuana. And I think it was enough to put him in jail for about a year with a felony. I don't know exact amount. I'm just gonna say X amount. So he had he, they had an X amount of uh, marijuana in his house. It couldn't have been his. It could have been his. He you know who knows you know it could have been someone else's. But it was in his house, it was in his possession, and, you know, he could be charged with a felony, and that can be up to a jail time of a year, which is pretty, uh, interesting. And, you know, all the white boy haters are probably going crazy right now, like, finally he's gone! But just remember, this guy's a human, I mean, just think about this, this guy, of course, smoking weed, but this guy wasn't even smoking it, but of course, you know, having weed is illegal, it's a legal drug, so, you know, you guys can say whatever you want, it is illegal, but I could care less if people smoke it, unless it's, unless I'm not in the room, uh, cause I do not smoke weed, I don't want to, so, uh, these people decided to smoke it, it's not like he's dealing it, it's not like he had so much m to put him away for 10 years, I don't know how the uh, law is where he lives, but uh, apparently he could be serving up to a year. So that's ridiculous because him and Kelly, his girlfriend, are sitting in jail right now, waiting for what's gonna happen. And he had a so he had such a successful YouTube channel. He's leaving behind, and it's not like he quit. He literally was forced away. And you know, when I looked at his latest videos. All I see in the comments is, oh, white boy, he should be going in jail. He's smoking weed. Weed's, weed is illegal. But, I mean, we all break the law every day. We all jaywalk or we all litter. You know, everyone breaks the law. And, of course, you know, one law is bigger than the other, like smoking weed or having weed. So, uh, it does, it's really unfortunate. I really have no opinion on it. Or I guess my opinion means I'm. it sucks. I feel bad for him. I wish this didn't happen because if no YouTube hater, or just a, so, someone that didn't like him, because obviously no one would just call a bomb threat on him just for no reason. 
But, you know, if he wasn't, like, had such a, so many haters or whatever, you know, people probably wouldn't have called a bomb threat on him, uh, which would have led to the police finding weed. It's not like they were saying, uh, oh, this guy has weed. They're not going to break into someone's house and say, yep, you have a bag of weed. We're going to put you away for a year or whatever. You know, they don't just do that. You know, they got to have certain reasons. Like, if there was a bomb, they could come in your house and, uh, Hopefully nothing bad really happens to White Boy. Hopefully it's a bail, cause you know then the all of us, all the fans, uh, could rise up and bail him out. But I don't know. But if it if he does have to serve a year a sentence, then that sucks, cause he's leaving a big YouTube channel behind. Um, and, you know you think oh he's not that big anymore. Two million subscribers is freaking big. Two million, you know. Is a lot. It's a big number. So don't you guys think, oh, he's not big anymore. Two million subscribers is a lot. And, you know, he, I was been, I've been subscribed to him for a while now. Oh, ever since, like, 2010 with Black Ops 1. You know, I was, we, we, I go way back. And he was like, a like a, I guess he was like a veteran on YouTube. So, uh, hopefully, you know, the, whatever happens, happens, you know. Hopefully we can, uh. And I made the stupidest move right here. <laughs> yeah, I fell off the map. Because that's what MW2 is like. So anyways, you know, it sucks. Like, what happened in the game and also what happened to White Boy. But, again, please don't, like, comment. Like, oh, we should have done it, you know. Because we already all heard it. You know, we know weed's illegal. But, you know, some people actually spoke it for medical conditions that are actually proven correct. And, you know. Whatever, so if you enjoy this video, you know what to do. Hit the like button, and other than that, this has been Jagnal, and I will see you guys next time.